Hey guys, today is August the 19th, 2017, and poor little Sparky yesterday. I didn't film him, film him yesterday, I was really busy, and he um, really did not want to be in his outside pen, and he really wanted playtime yesterday, and I was really busy, and I really didn't have time to take him over in the garden and let him enjoy himself, and... So he, when I went to get him, he looked like Wooly Willy uh, with um, substrate uh, all over his face, uh, that bed of beast that I put out in his outside pen. So today I am going to get him out in the garden and, um, you know, try to make up for yesterday. So what I had to do, he didn't want in his outside pen and I didn't have time to run him all over the garden yesterday. I had to try to work and watch him, um, you know, let him be able to explore the dining room, living room, kitchen, and the two sunrooms to let him get uh, get some of his energy um, out of him. So then I put him back in his outside pen, then he was okay. He just seemed like he wanted to have that. Uh, interaction time and, and be able to fight the chair leg, chrome chair legs, etc. that he normally does in his territorial mode. So now today I'm leaving everything go, including the breakfast dishes, and I'm going to take him over to the garden. You ready to roll, Sparky? Today is Sparky's day. So whatever Sparky wants to do, I'm just going to let him explore, do his thing. If he wants in the greenhouse, out of the greenhouse, Whatever he wanted to make up for yesterday. Right, Sparky? Okay, go to it. Don't scare the bluebird. Okay. We got a bluebird nesting, and the bluebird, every time he sees me, he flies off the nest. LP has stopped using the weed whacker, thank heavens, um, and he just cuts the grass, uh, and this is like a ground cover, so he just cuts it and lets it be, and the critters has got wild edibles, there's clover in here, and um, purslene over there, and the rabbits. They just love this area here that LP now just cuts. He cuts about four inches high, and then he lets the clippings go right back into the earth to give the nutrients that the um, earth, that the uh, soil needs. Okay, Spark, let's go up here and sit down. Sun yourself, okay? Sparky. Actually, I'm just going to pick him up and carry him. How's that? <laughs> like a good idea. Okay, just stay there. Okay, Sparky, you want to go? You want to go up here and I can sit down and you do your thing? Okay? He's not happy. There's his swim. There's his little, little, uh, what you call, uh, rant that he does. See, he doesn't want me to pick him up right now. So this is his little uh, hissy fit. Is this your hissy fit, Sparky? Huh? Is this hissy fit? Well, let's go up here. I'm not going to take you home. See, he loves being over here. And he's having his hissy fit. Okay, stop there. I want you to see the back of my shirt. <laughs> Time for a new shirt. Okay, now I'm going to earth, and 
I'm going to grab. Bear, speak up. That's good. Don't matter. Okay. I'm doing my earthing and grounding. And Sparky is loving this straw. I'm afraid of Sparky because I'm afraid of him because he will bite. He will bite my foot if I give him a chance. I know this is an instinctual thing, but you have to watch with a wild animal. Right, Sparky? Basically, you can't hardly see what I'm filming here, so we'll see. Even though he's eaten this morning, don't matter. If he could get a nibble on my foot, he's going to go for it. Right, Sparky? I was gutsy I would show you how he'll he will actually take try to take a bite and that's a fact Sparky's trying to get me. Yeah, he's trying to get me with them claws, them three claws. Yeah, he's mad. He's very mad because I got to go get a splinter out of my foot. 
So that's... Oh, he popped it that time. Yep. <laughs> he, he did a popper. That's the head popping. He's mad. He's really fit to be tied. So there you go.